Hey guys, what's going on? It's King Clutch here, and today, guys, we're back in the NBA 2K22. I hope you guys are having a great day and everything's going well for you guys. Today, I'm going to show you guys how you can build this LaMelo Ball build here in NBA 2K22. So, I'm going to be making this build here a point guard. I'm going to go right handed, jersey number one. Again, you could go with whatever jersey number or handedness you want. That doesn't really matter, guys. I'm going to go ahead and hit continue on this. For this build, I'm going to be making him 6'6, 180, 6'8 for the wingspan. Body shape doesn't matter. No, I couldn't find his exact wingspan, so I just went 6'8. Um, I just feel like that's a decently good wingspan for this build, guys, and I'm going to go ahead and go with this. Now, for this LaMelo build, there's quite a few ways you can do this, honestly, and I really don't think there's a right or a wrong way. It just kind of comes down to your play style, honestly. I feel like there's quite a bit you can change with this, like, when it gets to, do, like, the nitty-gritty of the build, the specifics of certain things. Um, obviously, there's baselines of everything you're going to want, but other things, I feel like you have a few choices. So with this build, I'm pretty much going to throw this uh, mid-range and this three-point up to an 89 and a 90. Now, this driving dunk. It's not like LaMelo's dunking on people, so what I'm going to do is give him an 85 driving dunk, and I still want this driving driving layup to be high because LaMelo can finish pretty well. Um, so we want that and I'm also going to touch the close shot. I feel like if you have a guard and you don't have a close shot or a driving layup, you're not going to be able to do anything in the driving lane. You're just going to get the ball squatted every single time and you obviously really don't want that. Um, with this build though, I would make sure you have some perimeter D and this vertical too you want up here. Um, I'm going to give this build, we'll give it an 80 vertical just so we're able to get that. Now, again, for these last few points, I'm going to spend this on block. All right, guys, so the big thing here on the defensive end is I wanted to get, be able to get bronze intimidator. So we're able to get that. But if you want to get chased on artist, if you guys look here, I feel like chased on artist is something you could use. You need a 57 block. So we got to hire this up by three. Um, so what I'm going to do is probably just lower this driving layup a little bit. I know that's going to make us take a hit when it comes to our finishing badges. Otherwise, just lower your close shot and I'd leave your driving layup. Uh, you can do that too. And same thing with this build. If you want to upgrade free throw, go ahead. You can use the build and wreck a little bit better if you'd like. Again, that's completely optional. Um, you can do whatever you'd like with that. Um, but again, there's a lot of tweaks you can make to this if you want to go, you know, more finishing, more playmaking, more defense, depending on how you want to do it. I'm going to go with this. I feel like this is pretty balanced. It's similar to them. But we're going to have 21, 31, 25, and 11 guys. Now, when it comes to these takeovers, you can pick whatever you want. Again, these are optional. You know, you pick whatever takeovers you want. Um, you don't have to pick the same ones I do. I'm going to go with pull-up precision, though, and ankle-breaking shots. And then for this build here, guys, I'm going to be getting here a two-way scoring machine. And for the shades of, we're going to be in Steve Nash, Deer, and Fox, and John Wall. We need to get his name there. I'm not too upset. I really feel like a two-way scoring machine is similar to LaMelo. He can do pretty much everything, you know, and he's going to develop into a better scorer as he gets into the league, as he stays in the league. Well, he's acrobat there on gold. I'm going to also use Limitless Takeoff and Posterizer here. I'll throw Fearless Finisher up to gold. And then the rest of these, you can kind of pick. I use Lob City Finisher just to help finish lobs in the park. And then I'm going to use Teardropper and Slithery Finisher. And for these shooting badges, I'm going to use Blinder, Circus Threes, and Deadeye all up to gold. Also, I'm going to go ahead and use Difficult Shots here. Catch, and then uh, Chef on gold, Corner on bronze. Fade Ace, I'm going to put up to silver, and then I'm going to throw Limitless Spot up here up to gold. And then for these last ones, I'm going to put Rhythm Shooter here up to silver. And for these playmaking badges, I'll use Ankle Breaker here, Quick First Step, Handles for Days, Hyper Drive, and Quick Chain. And I feel like LaMelo needs almost Break Starter, because sometimes he gets rebounds and throws the ball down, so I'll put that on bronze just to have it. Um, special Delivery, too, I would use Space Creator. You can use if you want. I'm going to throw that there. Um, but for the rest of these two, I'm going to use Tight Handles, stop and go unpluckable all on bronze now the reason i put these all on bronze is honestly some of them are kind of expensive to put up to silver but at least then i get the badges and i'll use bailout on bronze too um again you kind of have a few options on how you want to play that i'm gonna go with these though then for these defensive badges guys i'm gonna go and use intimidator here chase down artist pogo stick i'll use menace on bronze pick dodger will use it because we'll probably be getting screened a lot and then i'll throw clamps here interceptor and honestly i'm gonna use rim protector so we can have rim protector and chase an artist and get better block and leaping animations guys but this is how you can build this lamello ball build here in nba 2k22 if you guys are new to the channel please subscribe for more nba 2k22 builds but anyways guys it's banking clutch here hopefully you enjoyed the video anyways have a great extra day and peace out guys thanks